my dreams are crazy my dreams are like always very fantastical they have nothing to do with real life it's always like oh my gosh you have three relics one is a ceramic pocket watch on a silver chain and one is a gold ring and the other one is a brooch and these relics help you to communicate with those from the afterlife it's just like crazy shit but if you look at my paintings and you think about the general combination of colors with the atmosphere that you get from a painting that is very similar to the atmosphere in my dreams I heard like a quote somewhere that says the more words that are written about a painting the less you can see it I, I think that's quite true I would never be upset at anyone for interpreting one of my paintings differently than how I would have seen it my only hope is that it makes people think about something that they might not have been thinking about before. I have been making art for probably about as long as I can remember. I was born in the States, but I lived in uh, Hefei, China with my grandparents for five years, and my parents didn't live with me, so I actually didn't know them for that time. I think I have a very distant relationship with my parents because of it. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think they know that much about like what I do or why I do it. They don't really ask about my art ever. And I think that we have different, like very different outlooks on, on life as well. For them, it's just hard to understand how one can be so okay with putting so much at risk all the time. The summer after senior year, my parents were telling me to get a job, but I felt like I could spend my time doing something more productive instead of just like folding clothes all day or like making pretzels. Then I started like painting on shirts and seeing if that would sell. And uh, then I opened up an account on that, on the app where I sell clothes. So I now have like an online website. This is how I make money. You know, this is how I like cover like my spending, my food, my clothes, my like, just like activities, I guess. At its peak, I was making like $2,000 a month. It's easier to gain a following on here than it is on Instagram because here you're offering people something, you know, they're consuming. And I feel like I'm being productive, you know, I feel like I'm, I'm working towards something that's like under my own control. I'm not just like going to a job every day. I don't know, I never like to plan too far into the future. I, ultimately, I think I just like to have um, a nice well-lit studio with a dog and um, yeah, and just make paintings and yeah, I guess.